working out with these ball hog gloves is changing everything, the whole dynamic of the workout. It takes away your grip. So the ball slips out of your hands. You really gotta be able to control the ball. For quality basketball training products, go ahead and log on to ballhoggloves.com. God first, work until. We're done. You all empty. enjoy the broadcast. It's just gonna be a silent broadcast tonight <laughs> as we are underway here at the center. I'll end Kate with you on NBC Sports Philadelphia. Tobias, the hesitation, the drive, tries to tip it out. Comes to Rogier. Here's Hayward. Big on these catch and shoot threes and also big on the pull up threes in transition as Hayward hits one there. Mello always looking to push it. Hayward. Scoops it out to Bridges for three, who drills the top of the key triple. He's I was going to leave that part out. <laughs> Aesthetically, yes, yes. <laughs> and it's fairly good on the defensive end as well as he takes it away from Joel. And Hayward, the recipient of the fast break bucket. i got to say, you and I are both soccer fans. Yes. Sport that gets uh, yes. the most shade because of that. And that was, that was soccer worthy. It's a lot of feigning in soccer, yes, in football. Hayward, the bounce pass to Plumley. It's tangled up. Rozier, out to Hayward. Head fake, steps inside the arc, and drills the mid-range. What's this? Oh, clean! Lamello, free space in front of him! Awkward fast break, but it pays off for the bucket! Yeah. <laughs> Cork Maz and Andre Drummond's middle name at times. Let's see if either of them can help out here. That's not the way to do it. Book nine ahead of everybody. Your point would be <laughs> solidly backed up I, by video. I might have been able to go coast to coast if they played wow. defense like that, which is really saying something. We'll take it. That's the lead back to three. Gordon Hayward. Couldn't wait to get back onto the floor. 7-0-6ers run. That Maxi triple puts the Sixers in front. Maxi flies past Hayward, who resets and answers. Louisville product now in his seventh season. 27-year-old Terry Rozier came to Charlotte, a part of that Kemba Walker trade. And Plumley ahead of the pack. Tyrese hanging off the mark. Still looking to get that floater going. That's tough going from right to left. Hayward. Well, tried to go behind the back, lost it. This should be another easy run out bucket for the Hornets. I like the thinking behind it, try to go up strong. Tough start for Tobias, though. two for seven tonight, he's got six. Hayward, meanwhile, continuing to cruise. He's got 22 first half points. Lamello splitting the defense, back out to Gordon. Lowers the shoulder, no whistle. Plumley the easy two. Team not shooting well in the second quarter, and as a result, Hornets now on a 22-4 run, dating back to about the 7:30 mark in the second. The Hornets credit because they came out and started their offense quickly. But this can't happen. And the fans not happy with the effort, and either either is the head coach, Doc Rivers. 11 of 12. <laughs> He's not a robot. <laughs> Drawing the contact from Niang, fading, make it 28 for Gordon Hayward. You just know when watching a guy how the shots are falling. He Hayward leading all scores. He's got 28. Back to Lamello. Loader. And it's good. Lamello into double digits. Fourth Hornet now in double figures. Like they were ready to attack that zone. The ball stayed out along the perimeter and it wound up with Tyrese having to heave one up. Joel was doubled most of the possession. Gordon Hayward off the screen. Too easy. Make it 30 down for Gordon Hayward. Well, worth noting again, he and Lamelo and Mason Plumley were not available in the back-to-back -back games down in Charlotte as Bridges hits a big three. 